Leos, hey lovies, welcome back to another video. I miss you guys. Did you miss me? I appreciate all your likes, shares, and subscribes and how you're helping our channel grow. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you're having a beautiful day. Uh, hey, let's see what spirit has for you, Leo. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, and Holy Angels. Thank you so much for bringing me here with my Leos. Thank you for all you do in the Divine Realm. Seeing and unseen blessings you bestow upon us each and every day. Thank you for healing our hearts, minds, bodies, souls, and spirits. Giving us victory in every situation. Thank you for allowing us to be successful and abundant. And thank you so, so much for binding and banishing any negative energy, entities, witchcraft, or wickedness that may be coming up against my Leos or myself and this channel. We only draw from your divine realm of love, light, and spiritual wisdom and guidance. Amen. All right, Leos, let's see what's going on. I always cleanse the energy I pray on and off the camera. I'm a light worker. It's very important to me. And it's also very important for you, whether you believe it or not. Okay? But I got you. I got you. That's why I'm here. I'm here. Let's see what's going on with my Leo spirit. I saw some deception. I know that weasel ain't weaseling back around again. I thought he was gone. It's a he for a lot of y'all. Let's see what's going on with my Leo. I thought he was gone, Leo. Okay, messages, dreams. All right, so you're getting downloads. Somebody could definitely be trying to communicate with you in the 5D. Absolutely. Somebody is trying to communicate with you in the 5D. They are thinking about you. They are playing y'all songs. They're doing things to try to get you to come toward them. Or they're just thinking about you. Somebody misses you. Okay, you could be having um, um, dreams about this person. I feel like we all, for some of you, you're dreaming about when you were closer to this person. When you used to be around them, when they used to be around you. You're dreaming about this. Oh. <laughs> Trust in divine timing, though, that everything will play out the way it's supposed to. Right now, somebody could be hiding the fact of... Um, somebody could just be hiding their self. There's some kind of beliefs here. A facade. Somebody... Um, why is this here? <laughs> Somebody could be wearing a mask when it comes to their beliefs. My phone just chimed. That one is that what it's saying? Somebody wearing a mask. Mm, Lord, these water signs play a lot of games. You know what? I love y'all, so I ain't gonna go in all hard since now I got a new channel and it's for everyone. So I'm gonna be I'm gonna tread lightly. But these freaking water signs, y'all know y'all y'all. We love you guys. We need you guys. We love your energy. It's all bomb. But the other side of you, that shadow side, this, this, ugh, gave us a break. You know I'm an earth sign. I cannot take all that water and all that fakeness and making me all sad. Just ugh, give us a break, water signs. Look at this. A wet mess. Just water crying everywhere. Sad, sad, tears, sad emotions, more emotions. God help us all. We need balance. See, y'all need earth. Okay, you need us. You need me. Too much water. Leo, what you doing with all this water in your reading? Come on. Let's see. Let's see what's happening here. Oh, something triggered a fit in me. See, it's the water. It's all the emotions and crying and sadness. God, please. All right, we got limitations and fears. Huh. First the water works, now the fears. Okay? Somebody definitely is trying to work with their shadow side. I mean, one thing you're tired of, Leo, is this person whipping a mask out every chance they get. You want to know where the hell they're getting all these different personalities from. Where are these masks coming from? Who are you, bruh? Who are you, sis? Can you just let us know? Right, Leo? Just let me know. I'm sick of the surprises. Let's just work it out, okay? I know. I feel you, Leo. You One thing you are is a team player. But some of my Leos, y'all having dreams about somebody, waiting for divine timing to come into play because you're hiding the fact of how you, that you feel for this person. There's some type of beliefs here that you're indulging in, and it probably is not really how you feel. I feel like some of you really need to take a deep look in the mirror and examine yourself. For some of my male Leos here, 
Find out what actually makes you happy. What is this that you're really standing for? Whatever you're indulging in. Some of you could be doing something, beliefs with the church, religion, things like that. But I feel like there is some part of you that you are not being honest with. You have to examine yourself. I mean, if you're a religious person, Leo, and you're into church and things like that, you already know. Govern yourself accordingly. God says examine thyself, okay? The same way you can look at somebody else's situation, you're supposed to be taking that mirror and looking right at yourself and making sure you're not living a deceptive life or you're not living a lie. Some of my Leos here, some of my male Leos are settling in a situation that they're truly not happy in. You just took on somebody else's path in life. I mean, I feel like, did you even explore what you wanted to do or did you just save face? Did you just save face? Just to be a part of something that seems stable and at least it's good enough for you for now. I mean, it could be anything. Take it as it resonates, guys. You know, these are general. These are general. Okay. So, let's see. So, we got vanity and pride, regret and integration. So, let's go ahead and put them out how I feel it. I feel like these um, somebody is definitely dreaming about you or you're dreaming about somebody. Um, you're remembering when you two are together and things like that. I'm feeling like for some of you, you already may have a relationship, but you're, this person from the past is on your mind. You're feeling deep regret about not taking the opportunity that you had to see this person. You had an opportunity to be with this person. For some of my male Leos here, you did. For some of my female Leos, this person is thinking about you. They want to come back. Not that the females can't be going towards someone, but that's not the energy I feel. Mm -mm. No. I feel for the female Leo... There's somebody dream you're dreaming about this person and thinking about this person because they're they're trying to pull you in from the 5D. They're they're manifesting you. And I feel like divine timing is gonna show you. And also this person, you're gonna be able to see this person's real face. You're gonna see through these lies and things like that. And if it's um for my male Leos, you're gonna be able to talk to someone, okay? Um, this is someone you can be vulnerable with. This is someone you can share your feelings with. I feel like this is someone you could talk to about anything. And this person cares for you, Leo. They'll listen. All right? This must be a friend. Maybe somebody you knew from um, childhood. Um, but somebody is definitely thinking. Somebody is emotional. Feeling a bit sad. Somebody may be thinking about how much of a loving person you are. I feel like some of you are thinking about this Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Oh, my gosh, Leo. What the heck? <laughs> Let's see what's going on. For some of you, it could be a baby mama, baby daddy. That's a water sign, thinking about them. Show me messages and dreams. Leo, this person is only in mind. Somebody wants to marry you, or you're in a marriage. Yeah, you're in a marriage already, and you're having dreams about somebody from the past. Yeah, some type of karmic relationship. So let's see turmoil resentment lessons letting go and loving you watching looking stalking gaslighting perception focusing out so leo um i feel like this is somebody that you were in a relationship with or a commitment with somebody that possibly wanted you to be their significant other or you could have held the title with each other calling each other your husband or your wife okay trust and divine timing is here though because this person just gaslights you they call you telling you whatever you want to hear and they know you're loving, sweetheart. They know you really want a chance with them. But, I mean, honestly, the truth be told, this person is very self-absorbed, okay? This person is very much worried about what they want, all right? And I feel like because this is a karmic relationship, this person is going to continue to drill in your head to put yourself first and your self-worth first and stop letting them come and sweet talk you. They're going to do it. Or they're going to hurt you over and over again. The separations, this person is missing you, all right? For some of you, you have hopes of talking to your person. For some of you, I mean, all of your person, all of you don't have a bad person. Some, some of you, the timing was just wrong, or you two had to see something through. Like both of you had something to tie up or end, and you guys were doing that. Okay, you were taking your time, um, seeing that thing through until you know it was time for you to come together. So I do see that here. Um, transcending obstacles, a new phase and preparing for union, interested in conversing more, a weighted message arrives. So you're going to be getting a message that you've been waiting for. feel like somebody is going to expose themselves. They're going to take the mask off, okay? Um, for some of you, it's talking to this person is like looking in, li looking in a mirror. 
talking to this person is like talking to yourself for some of you. It's like this person mirrors you. What's the facade? Somebody's keeping a facade. The facade is that they're frustrated in their relationship. They're hiding it. You're dealing with somebody that um, could be dealing with somebody else and they want out of it. I feel like somebody feels like you self-sabotage this connection. All right. I feel like somebody was feeling like they're not enough or feeling like they're not enough and they were jealous. Okay. So we do see that at the top. I feel like that's the overall energy and love. There's love here that's causing this turmoil. Um, and you got trust in divine timing that everything is going to play out just as it should. Wow, Leo. <laughs> Leo, I love you. You got some deep messages. I'm glad I'm here to help. Okay. Because I see just like us Virgos that y'all have a good heart and you have people coming to try to take advantage of you too. Um, and I see that. I do. You're very strong, but at the same time, you're a hard worker. You're focused and you're a team player. So you try to play along with these people in hopes that they're going to do the right thing. But some of them just are jack butts, you know. Some of them, you could have children with them, guys. For some of you, some of you, this person that wants to come back, you could have a child with them. Um, fears and limitations, balance. One person is giving too much in this relationship. Leo, that's you. You're giving way too much in this relationship, okay? Um, and I feel like, yes, there's children here. Somebody could be pregnant. <sighs> I'm feeling like you're giving too much in this relationship. You're overextending all of you. Pretty soon, Leo, for some of you, for my males, you're going to explode. You're going to leave. You're going to just abruptly let this person have it have an emotional overpour and just leave right i see that here your true love is already a part of your life so for some of you whoever's watching me um spirit wants you to know that you've met your true love already okay for some of you you already know it for some of you, you have children with this person leo spirit is telling you that this situation is requiring balance okay somebody is regretting a new love or a recommitment of love or regretting not being able to do that with you because they want it. Somebody is telling you to lean on your inner circle at this time because this person is very vain and prideful. You know, and it's hard for you to see through their lives because they care about you. Somebody is having obsessive thoughts. They are isolating themselves and thinking very, very deep thoughts about you. This person is obsessed with making things work. They're obsessed with you. They want things to work. I feel like a lot of them are very much beside themselves because they screwed this up. Okay, let's see what Spirit wants you to do with the Tyrone. Spirit, tell me for Leo, well, how should Leo move forward in this situation with this person? Where are my cards? Um, over here. <laughs> I got him, Leo. Let's see. How should Leo move forward with this person? We're going to put a Tarot card on each. Show me the children. Children are important to this partnership for Leo and integration. Somebody um, may be thinking about integrating families and how it would be. Um, somebody wants their child to live with them. And they want to make sure that this is a situation that will provide that for them. Okay? For some of you, they want to live with their children. They try to use the children as an excuse. You're breaking up the family and blah, blah, blah. Leo, don't fall for that. Some of you Leos could feel like they're breaking up the family. But if you know this person is not... This person is not trying to do right. Don't worry about it, okay? So, for some of you, I feel like there is a younger Knight of Pentacles here that is deciding to, um, with the Two of Swords in reverse, this is talking about needing to make a decision, um, talking about ignoring something, or somebody could have been blocked, so somebody is wanting to be unblocked, or somebody unblocked somebody. So, Leo, if this person had you blocked, you're unblocked now. <clears throat> balance okay so oh queen of swords in reverse somebody is reckless with the mouth cussing you out just being very very rude this person bringing all kinds of confusion for you leo it could be a mother figure a baby mother or anything for some of y'all it could be a taurus um bringing confusion the taurus could feel like you're kind of reckless or just very <laughs> cutthroat for some of you you cut this taurus off or you cut this person off like in a heartbeat you're just like nope bye yeah i feel like it was an argument or something like that you unblock this person 
or this person didn't make a decision to come towards you, but I feel like somebody was blocked and then you unblocked them. When you unblock them, you told them about these options, you cussed them out, you told them about bringing you all this confusion and crap like that. Some of them could have a wife or you could have been telling them that I'm your wife and blah, 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 or you supposed to have married me. Something is here where it's an empress energy. It could be a Taurus or a wife and they are pissed, okay? You cussed this person out. You cuss this damn person out. Look at this. You cuss this person out. Why? Because of confusion and options and them just not doing right. All right. Show me. <laughs> show me what why Leo cussed this person out, Spirit. What did they do? Why did Leo get so upset? Oh, okay. So they tried to manipulate a situation. We got the um. Oh, okay. Oh, okay okay all right so somebody does not want to be left out in the cold you cuss them out because of a third party and because they were manipulating the situation and now all of a sudden they don't want it to be over they i feel like somebody was giving up on faith and losing faith in this situation they don't want it to be left out in the cold and i feel like with the five of pentacles in reverse i mean the page of pentacles in reverse this person could be in lack not having any money um this person is saying they don't want to be broke, they don't want to be left out in the cold, and they don't want this to be over. Somebody is like not learning their karmic lesson. Oh, gosh. Okay. So somebody is asking a Virgo not to leave them behind also. <laughs> What's balance in here and now? Leo, y'all really connecting with my energy because y'all readings are getting longer and longer. You know, it's not my first page. That's how I know that you guys are really getting healed from your messages. Somebody is watching me faithfully and this is helping them evolve. Leave this piece of trash behind. I mean, I'm sorry for calling y'all person a piece of trash, but some, Leo, you got to keep it real and don't be walking in denial. Some of these people are a piece of trash and you know it. It's because they're proud of it, shit. They don't care and you shouldn't either, okay? You, you're not their savior. Let them go to God if they need help because you have a family, you got children, you got your money to look after. You don't have time to play parent to this person, male or female, Y'all need to stop picking these females up, too, off the ground. How the hell did they get there in the first place? You ain't knock them down. And I'm not saying don't have a heart, Leo. I love y'all. Y'all have a heart of gold. But you have to see when these people are trying to use you. And if somebody not giving you what you need in a relationship, it's time for you to... Where that, where that, where's that picture at, Leo? We need to go back and get it. Okay. It's time for you to do this. Yes. All right? Because you deserve, you deserve, you deserve, you deserve, you deserve. And that's why, all right? No, it's nobody else's business how you don't need to explain anything. As long as you know that and God is pouring into you, you let your spirit guides like me pour into you. Make sure you're using your discernment, who you're letting pour into you. Don't don't let people speak into your life that, that don't know you. And don't let anybody manipulate you and try to make you do anything you don't want to do. This person want to come back in. This person doesn't want to um, lose you, but at the same time, this person has lessons to learn that they're refusing to learn, all right? This person is willing to leave a third-party situation. I feel like right here, it is um, somebody that maybe this person had you going to take them everywhere. I feel like you were like leaving your kids or leaving the family, and this person had you out doing stuff for them, running around. Dump, time out for that. You're, you're done with that. And then also you could have been, this person could have been just out being reckless with third parties. With the three of wands in reverse, that's cheating. With this um, knight of swords, that's reckless. All right. And with this um, four of cups, that's you saying, <laughs> no ma'am, no ham, no turkey, no cheese. This is like you're saying, um, oh hell no. You're not dealing with it. Here and now. Here and now, your true love is a part of your life. Leo, for some of you, you have a, a Virgo, queen of pentacles, that is a part of your life, and this is your true love. I feel like you are standing your ground. You're trying to get yourself out of this situation because you want to go toward this beautiful thing right here, honey. Yeah, I'm a, king, I'm a queen of pentacles also, and I believe that this card is just very beautiful. She looks very beautiful. She just looks very um, stern, though, like she does not play. I don't know do I look like that. <laughs> just like, <laughs> she looks so mysterious and just... <laughs> oh, gosh. All right, y'all. But, yes, Leo, for some of my male Leos out here watching, 
Um, you got one fight left. This nine of wands, I feel like you're, and for some of you, Leo, for my female Leos, you could actually be in this queen of pentacles energy, just super abundant, have everything you need, solid and everything. A good mother, you know, a lot of your children helped you um, become um, more the queen of pentacles energy, you know? Um, grounded, stable, secure, problem solver, everything, okay? And this person, trust me, they missed that. Some of this per some of these people missed the bus. <laughs> they really did. They missed the daggone bus. Look, you ended it with them. Sure did. New love is here. Oh, my God. Wedding. Look at this. Sorry, so something. Mm -mm -mm. So, okay. Somebody is regretting. The fact that they had an opportunity to be with you. They had an opportunity to have new love with you. Go through a whole transformation of their life. They had an opportunity to marry you. Take your relationship to a high level commitment. Everybody would have been congratulating them and on their side. And they also had an opportunity to re um, reject all this toxicity. And um, stop, being, stop being out in the streets. Look, this person want to mature. Look at this. You got a king of pentacles here, honey. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo. This person thinking about it. They're going to call you with a death card. Endings bring new beginnings. Somebody is going to be looking forward to being in a relationship. Somebody is going to call you, Leo, and they're going to be talking to you. Um, somebody is interested. For some of y'all, <laughs> this is also, you are very financially stable, and this person is in King of Pentacles energy. They also are very financially stable. Okay? Five of Swords, but does somebody feel defeated? Oh, Lord, by that child's mother that's holding on to them for their life. Lord have mercy. Some of them feel bad because you're their child's mother, Leo, and they want you back. Somebody is going to be contacting you about a new beginning. For some of my Leos, you guys are single and abundant and independent. I see that here. Somebody is going to be contacting you for a new beginning. They're going to be showing you some love. For some of you, you got a water sign or a fire sign coming towards you. Leo, this is you also being very loving. You could be coming towards somebody. For my male Leos, you can get on your little horse and be charming them. You know, hey girl, let me talk to you. You know, and for my females, you just sitting pretty. Sitting pretty, okay? And I feel like for a lot of you, you're matured out of this queen of wands energy. Even though you're still feisty and all of that. You're more of a homebody. You take care of home. You build your finances. A lot of you are working home from home. So that's this queen of pentacles energy. Also just very grounded because you're at home a lot. Okay. I see that. All right. But um, yeah, you got somebody thinking about you heavy. This person is contemplating before they come towards you. <laughs> somebody is getting drunk. They need to cut it out. Somebody is hitting that bottle. All right. Thinking about you getting drunk. And they're waiting. Somebody wants to invest in a lover situation, a fiery passion, a new beginning. But this person is not really there. Somebody is planning. They want to be there but not there. Because they don't want to lose you. But as, at the same time, they have a lot that they're working on. For some of y'all, it's a, a king of cups. Cancel, cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. That's thinking about you. I told you, it's somebody trying to communicate with you in the 5D. They keep thinking about you. And y'all know water signs are... I've seen this water sign up here. Some of y'all dealing with the water sign hands down. Okay? And this person got you all figured out. Okay? I'm talking about from the nook to the cranny. They got you all figured out. Hmm. Yeah. You make this person happy. They coming towards you. Somebody going to come towards you and say sorry. Somebody spying on you right now as we speak. Somebody wants to release all the secrets. Be open and honest with you and let you know how they feel. They realized they brought the tower down because you found out their secrets, Leo. You're intuitive. Some of y'all are intuitive with this daggone water in your chart. Some of y'all have water in your chart and some of y'all have Virgo in your chart. Y'all better go ahead with the Virgo in your chart, Leo. You better go ahead with the Virgo in your chart, okay? Right, anyway, <laughs> somebody about to contact you. So get ready, sweethearts. Leo, you are brave. You have the upper hand. You know what to do. Don't, don't overthink it. Keep the ball in your court. Let this person speak their peace. Nothing wrong with being humble, loving, and kind. But you don't have to be a fool. And you do not have to submit to this person after they, after they confess. You can accept their apology. But you don't have to open your legs, home, refrigerator, or anything like that. Or your wallet. Don't ever open your wallet. But you don't have to do none of that. Okay? You don't. 
this person know they screwed up big time okay and they're obsessed they want to heal it they're obsessed with the idea of healing and um spirit is telling you to lean on your friends for support if you feel like you're in this energy of being really sad okay but i feel like you're obsessed with healing things with this person i feel like somebody somebody loves you and you did not pay this person much mind and now this person has let go and you want them back that's for a lot of you all right so i feel like that's the group that's a lot for a lot of you that's the group i'm reading for like with this um it's you feeling like you're a little bit burning or just overwhelmed with everything some of y'all could be in a marriage burdened by choosing the wrong person okay yeah when the person that you really want is out on the outside like a lot of y'all some of y'all some of you the per they want you you know but they're stuck in a relationship and for some of you leos that's watching me it's you that's stuck in a relationship you're not really happy and you can't be with the person that you really want to be with you already made your choice for some of you all right, Leo, so this is your reading, loveys. I need to leave these cards out because I got to find one for the screenshot thing. I'm so over that stuff. But anyway, I'm going to do it because <laughs> y'all like it. Let me get you a self-love um, card. Self-love affirmation. Keep going. You are on the right path. The seeds you are planting will grow. Success is guaranteed. Don't doubt yourself, okay? Keep going. Whatever you're doing is going to continue to be blessed and abundant. I feel like you're in the right energy. You're staying in a positive, balanced energy where you're um, making everything balanced for everyone, not just you. And so spirit, therefore, is taking care of you. So don't worry, Leo. Things are going to be looking up. You will eventually will see things play out with this person. Um, don't worry. Trust in divine timing, okay, loveys? All right. In the meantime, in between time, love on each other. Stay safe. All right, and love on me. <laughs> if you want a personal reading, my email address is closer, the number two, my destiny, and then number one at gmail.com. I was going to do three videos a day, family, but I really need to charge my energy. So that's what I'm going to do, okay? I will see you tomorrow, I promise. All right. Um, all right, Leo. I love you and I mean it. Bye.